This is a brand new Turkish drone that Russia is afraid of. The jet engine Kizilelma is capable of traveling 900 kilometers per hour. Turkey announced at the end of August 2022 that it had successfully completed the prototype of the two newest stealth combat drones, namely the Red Apple Kizilelma. This week, the Kizilelma drone maker Baykar revealed the technical specifications of this dreaded Russian drone. Turkish private defense company Baykar has developed the Kizilelma, a new unmanned stealth attack drone, equipped with Evchenko jet engines to fly at supersonic speeds. Baykar via his Twitter account announced that the Kizilelma drone is ready to start testing and is targeted to be operational in 2023. The Bear Actor Kizilelma is a stealth fighter drone with a jet engine capable of flying at supersonic speeds. This drone was developed under the MIUS Neurepensance's UCAC System E project or Unmanned Combat Aircraft System slash UCAS. This new Turkish-made combat drone was only presented on August 4, 2021 or a year after the Bayraktar Kizilelma reached the prototype stage. The Kizilelma drone is capable of traveling at a speed of 900 km per hour, capable of carrying 1,500 kg of missiles and bombs, flying at an altitude of 12,000 meters, autonomous, accepting missions under human control, and designed to be undetectable by radar. This drone can land and take off on its own on short tracks. The Kizilelma drone offers a low cross-section radar RCS supersonic aircraft capability and is equipped with an AESA radar for detection and guidance systems. Maneuverability Thus, the internal compartments will allow war the Kizilelma drone has installed control canards for better king in contested environments while maintaining low visibility. Flying at supersonic speeds in the coming months, Kizilelma will become the main enemy of the Russian military since the start of the war between Russia and Ukraine. The first tests of the drone will likely be on Ukrainian territory, given that the country could add stealth fighters to its arsenal. Baykar CEO Oluk Bayraktar said friendship and cooperation with Ukraine has been going on for many years. All our support is completely on the side of Ukraine because we have very strong relations and this country has experienced many unfair, aggressive and baseless attacks. Nothing will obscure our cooperation. Whatever the situation, our position on this matter is clear, from the Bulgarian military website. 